Good morning, Wido. Today is Thursday, October 6th, and here are your morning announcements. This is just a reminder, Kona Ice is tomorrow. Bring your 3 to $6 if you'd like to purchase Kona Ice. Uh, we are hosting a CHS 8th grade night this year on Wednesday, October 12th from 5.30 to 7 p.m. Uh, from 5.30 to 6, we'll meet in the auditorium and then have a club sports club slash sports booth set up in the gym for parents, students to visit. This will be at Colerain High School. Uh, please check the lost and found in the cafeteria. These items will be soon donated. So if you lost something, somebody might have found it, and it's in a box in the cafeteria, go find it down there. Uh, no cell phones at any time from arrival to dismissal. No, 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 no cell phones. If you need to call home, come to the main office, we'll let you call home from there. Today, we only have bus number 80 canceled today. For my math folks, that's 8 times 10. Bus 8 times 10 is canceled today. Lunch procedures and expectations. Stay seated at all times. Raise your hand to get up for the restroom only. We will come to you with a pass. Trash will be collected by tables. And students, you must have permission to get up. Uh, tomorrow for breakfast, whoa, we have mini sinnies. Looks like mini sinnies. That sounds delicious. 100% assorted fruit juice and chilled fruit and milk. Today for lunch, we have Burger Bash from Burger King. So it looks like everybody's getting Whoppers. Uh, spicy chicken salad, ham and cheese sandwich, turkey and cheese sandwich, yoga lunch, and peanut butter and jelly sandwich. As always, fan favorite, carrot sticks. Uh, oops, going to be stinking the hallways again. Baked beans, 100% assorted fruit juice and milk. And then really quickly, Miss Lynch, did you have something you wanted to add? Yeah, I wanted to talk about some new live school rewards that we got to share with you guys. I updated... Um, the form, and just so you know, if you didn't see it last week, it is available in Clever to fill out the Google form. Make sure you only select the items you want to purchase. Some of you, if you submit something and you don't have enough points, I will email you and let you know, but each box, only select the ones that you have enough for that you want to purchase. So we have tubs of cotton candy, we have some bracelets, we have some gibbets you can pick out. What's a gibbet? Oh, for Crocs. The little things that go across. Oh, Hold on. Cool. Okay. Is that a Pokemon This one? is a Pokemon. We got some like catch them all. star ones. I got some like stickers you can put on your water bottles, Gatorade bottles. We have full size candy bars and a few other things. Um, Lollipop pool will be at lunch today. And then tomorrow you will get your other rewards. I'm sorry, are those Takis? Oh, yeah. Sorry, I forgot. Takis too. Yeah. So these are all updated in on the Google form if you want to purchase anything. However, if you fill it out today, you probably won't get it until next week because I kind of close it off on Wednesdays. Um, and yeah, so, so you pass those out on Friday. Yes, the the physical rewards get passed out on Friday. The lollipop pool is on Thursday. The, those of you who are purchasing basketball, you get a pass with the date on it um, and the directions on how to redeem it. So if I purchase something today, I don't see it today. Probably not. It's, it's like Amazon Prime. You got to buy it today and you'll get it in a day or two. Okay. Or next Friday. Or next probably Friday. Ne if I yeah. buy it on a Thursday, probably. Yeah. I, I might. Friday. I sometimes can get the things that are submitted on Thursday by the next day, but not always. So I yeah. understand you're only one person. You're doing an amazing job. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Those are some cool one. prices. If you eat Thank those talkies on the go, they're walking talkies. <laughs> ah, oh, that was a poor <laughs> um, And I, get the blue Gatorade. If I buy the talkies, can I eat them at school? I pass them out specifically during lunch because, oh, you're smart. I, yes, I know. So you can eat them during lunch. It is up to teachers whether they let you, let you snack during class. So that's why I don't pass them out during like homeroom or something yeah. like that. So yeah. So if my teacher says, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm obnoxious. With no, you're good. This is good. If my teacher says, hey, Jen, put those away. You can't have them in class. Should I throw a fit? But I earned them. Oh, it would be respectful and responsible if you follow directions. I would roll them up so they don't fall out and put them in my book bag and then use something to look forward to after school. There you go. So not on it. the bus. You heard it here, folks. No no I'm making a big scene. You can't even see me in the camera. <laughs> All right. Oh, hello. More questions, Miss Stokes. I think I'm done. Okay. All right. All right. So keep doing good. Keep following the three R's and you guys are doing great earning your live school points. Yes, they are. Make it a great day. We do have a couple of things to counselors, Joe. Let me just. On. Well, I do. I'm a, being your mom today. Oh, there I am. Thanks. Um, you want to reenact what you just did? <laughs> no, I'm not going to reenact.
right? What can you repeat that eighth grade um, parent night for Corian High School next week? Uh, just a reminder: we are hosting college or college Colerain High School eighth grade night this year. This year on Wednesday, October twelfth, from five thirty to seven. From five thirty to six, you will meet in the auditorium and then have club and sports booths set up in the gym for parents and students to visit. Reminder: this will be at Colerain High School. Okay, so eighth graders, this is your chance to go over to Colerain High School, hear all about the programs, hear about the sports tour the building um we don't do a tour with you over at the high school we used to a long time ago if you have older brothers sisters cousins who have talked about that next wednesday evening is your chance to go over there mm -hmm. so eighth graders take advantage of that if you plan on going to Corrine high school and even if you're not planning on check going, it out go check it out and take the plans might change so True and enough. if you have an older sibling you Probably been to Corrine, that would be fair to say, but this is your turn. So That's take right. advantage of it. That's right. Yeah. Um, I have carrots were for lunch, and that triggered me to talk about lunch. Um, I don't know why, but you guys get carrots in your hand and you think that you must throw them. You must not, actually. Please don't. <laughs> and there are adults in the room and cameras everywhere, and uh, we will catch you. So don't do it. That's it's that simple. Don't throw care. Be civilized people. Go back to the pool at lunch. Yes. Um, dismissal is going a little better, but you know, there's a couple of you still trying to do whatever you want to do. And we will, I, I will come personally escort you. I did yesterday and it was quite fun. So don't um, let that be you. Just do the right thing. You know what it is by now. Okay. All right. Our mindful moment for today is called, or mindful moment. Yeah, yeah, sure. We're getting all the titles. Journaling. Get a notebook or journal and pen. Write out what is stressing you out as well as making you happy. Use it to record the highs and lows of your day and the meaningful events that happened. Acknowledge your proud moments. Why do we do this? Writing in a journal can help us to process our thoughts and feelings, problem solve, and brainstorm. It can also be a place to write down things that we don't want to forget, such as a positive event or something we are proud of. I know a lot of kids who do journaling. I know a lot of adults who do. Mm -hmm. um, I know some some kids started journaling because somebody as a gift gave them a journal, or maybe they purchased one at the book fair. Um, sometimes it's as easy as having just, my goodness, a blank notebook in front of you and the chance to write down how you're feeling. Sometimes people share their journals with other people. I've had um, students show things to me that they wanted to share. Um, sometimes nobody gets to see the journal, yeah. and that's cool too. Maybe you write it all down and then you destroy it. Yep. Yeah, I've done that with kids actually. That could be therapeutic. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Um, I like to call those brain dumps where you just those write down good. everything going on in your brain, get it out on paper, and then it's like a relief. It's you're you can done help with, with anxiety. Yeah. yeah, for sure. So that's a good tool. Um, it is Think It Through Thursday. And we were going to, yesterday when we were on, we were going to ask for students to submit um, things that they would like us to model thinking it through. Yes. Yeah. Kind of talking out some some common situations and problems that middle school kids might be having. Um, it, it's it's nice because this isn't an even though you'd be submitting kind of a concern or a question to us online, we would love to kind of talk it through. Um, our guess is if you're having a problem or an, or an issue, other kids are having a similar problem or issue. Um, so we're going to try to do that on Thursdays. Kind of uh, an uh, what on-air counseling kind yeah. of session. Uh, just talking through some issues. We won't say your name. If you submit no. an issue, we will not use any names no. at all, ever. No. It will be private to whoever you sent it with. We'll just discuss the issue live. Yeah. Um, so if you have something that you think might be useful and uh, submit it to your counselor, just email them and we might share it. If we don't share it, it just wasn't maybe an appropriate thing for us to use or would it be easy to do um, here? So. And if you want to talk personally with us about whatever the issue is, go to Clever, go to our sign up sheet and sign up yeah. to see us or send us a separate email about it. Yeah. Anything else? Not for today. Tomorrow's Friday already. That's good stuff. We've got conferences tonight. A lot of your parents are coming mm -hmm. this evening and then again next Wednesday. 
Um, that's good stuff. We love yeah. seeing your moms and dads. Remember, make good choices and keep your hands to yourself. We Still. talked about that yesterday. Yeah. I don't know why it's such a thing this year and last year, but it's not appropriate and you will be in trouble. So it's getting a lot of kids in trouble. It we is. need you here at school. We don't need you out of school. And we don't want you in trouble. That is not our, what we wake up to do in the morning. No. It's not why we all went to school for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> not even close. No. <laughs> All right, I think that's all. I think that's it for today. Yeah. Make it a great day. Get organized. Yes. You got a lot to do today and tomorrow. The quarter ends next week. Yes. Bye.